It's because I'm crazy, right? No one's calling you crazy. So why am I in a straitjacket? You need to be restrained in case you try to hurt yourself or others. Are you afraid of me? No, man. I'm not afraid of you. Why should you be? I'm tied up in this little room. I'm at your mercy. Aaron, please try to focus. Tell me why you attempted suicide. Tell me why you had it. Were you depressed, Aaron? What kind of question is that? Of course I was depressed. Why is that? You wouldn't believe me. It doesn't matter whether or not I believe you. Anything you tell us will help us find a way to cure you. Please answer my question, Aaron. I lost my girlfriend. She left you? She died. How? She went out into the sun. She went out into the sun? She was a vampire, you see. I told you you wouldn't believe me. Aaron, as I said before, what matters is that you tell us everything you can. Did they find the body yet? Of course they didn't. You don't find a vampire once they're dead. Tell me what happened, Aaron. And if I don't? Okay, okay, I'll play your game. But what you have to realize about vampires is that they're dead, inside and out. They're dead and there's no escaping it. Let's try and see the story, Aaron. How did you meet her? I had a gig downtown. I saw her standing near the back. Pale skin, almost luminescent. Long, blonde hair. The longest hair I've ever seen. And even from the stage, I could see her vibrant red eyes. I approached her after the show. When I reached her, it was almost like she'd been waiting. And if I didn't know any better, I would say I was in love at first sight. Did she say anything to you? No, she just looked at me with those eyes. Just looked at you? She left without a word. After that, I saw her everywhere. It became an obsession. I was half in love with her and didn't even know her name. Of course not. One day she came up and started talking, like we'd already been having a conversation. She told me her name, Morgan. We talked for hours, almost until sunrise, then she kissed my cheek and left. When did you see her again? The next night she showed up in my apartment, picked up right where we left off. God, she was amazing. What did you talk about? Everything. Books, music, life. I told her everything about me. It took two months for me to fall head over your freaking heels. Aaron? I guess my heart figured it out before my brain did. I mean, she wasn't exactly keeping it a secret, but I never should have overestimated her. What do you mean? She was so strong. I thought she was invincible. I kept her out late, too late. And she died. Her face turned gray with ash. Flames leapt across her thrashing form and blackened her skin as she burned. We need you to quiet down here. You strap me down and put me in this little room and strip away my insanity and freedom? I may be insane, but I'm still a human being. I'm a human being!